Hi and welcome to this edition of Mobile Tech Videos. Today we'll be talking about the auto shutdown problems that are plaguing the Captivate. Uh, a number of you may have experienced this. It's basically uh, when your phone turns off automatically. That was actually just a timeout. But uh, it turns off automatically and uh, you have no idea that it happened. Samsung has actually released an internal press uh, release regarding this. And they've also given us a specific list of IMEI ranges. Um, those are actually provided for you in the more info section. Uh, so you may be eligible for a, uh, a return um, if you are one of these people. In the meantime, uh, some people experience this issue multiple times a day. Some people experienced it only once or twice in the past five, six months. Uh, but regardless of who you, which one you are, there is a, there's a solution um, that you can try. Uh, what I would like to do when I see this issue, especially with my users uh, at work, is I like to go out to the market and I get the uh, set CPU for root users app. It's $1.99 in the market. I will link you over to the XDA developers thread where it is free. But uh, if you do appreciate the work, uh, you will buy or you will donate. It really would help this guy out. Uh, he's made a miraculous app to do a lot of cool things. And one of them happens to be that it, it kind of corrects the auto off problem. Uh, so we've gone ahead and installed it. So we'll go ahead and open up set CPU. And when we do this, we're going to see this type of screen. I always go with the auto detect speeds and say OK. You need to be rooted to do this. Um, obviously, I have root videos for 2.1 and 2.2 Android systems. Allow it when you get prompted for super user. After that, you'll see settings saved. Uh, now, as we mentioned, the app's available in the App Store, and we also linked you to the XDA developers thread. Uh, if you need help on getting that application installed, after you download it, please see my side loading video as well as my ADB commands video. They'll help you get that taken care of. Uh, once we got it installed, we want to take a look at what we've got going on here. Now we've gone ahead and dialed ours up to around uh, 200 minimum clock. Uh, this isn't an overclocked unit right now. This is Perception Build 9.5. But uh, we've gone ahead and upped our clock to 200. Stock out of the box, we're looking at 100. That was causing some issues. We were getting turnoffs almost every 10 to 15 minutes with this. Uh, so after that, after we've set our scale, we want to set that on boot. Now after this, I like to make a profile. And I like to enable the profile. Once you do that, you can add it. Say OK. And for the profile, I like to pick screen off. And then I set it to 200. And I set the priority to 100%. And I save the profile. And then I like to show it in the notifications bar. Now what this does is any time the screen is off, it makes a condition in which the minimum scale will only be 200 CPU. I've consistently found that this change in almost all cases prevents the auto off. This phone, for example, with Perception 9.5 was turning off probably once every 10 to 15 minutes. After the change, it's been on for around 36 hours just sitting, uh, sitting on the desk at my house. It's a spare Captivate I have. And... Um, I mean, I've got to say that I've been impressed with the results and I wanted to share these with you. So, uh, to recap, if you are one of the, the unlucky few experiencing the auto off problems, download Set CPU, scale it down to 200 for the minimum clock, set that on boot, go to Profiles, create a profile for screen off, set the priority to 100, the max, you can max it out, the min, you can minimize it down to 200. Enable it, run the notification, you'll have it in the bar right there for the main profile. Uh, in addition to this, you can set up a whole bunch of profiles to really maximize battery life. Uh, you can set it for charging to be maxed out 100, 1000, 1000, uh, to give you full performance at all times. And you'll notice some really cool speed increases when you do things like that. So, uh, that, set, that set CPU for root users to handle the Samsung automatic shutoff problem brought to you by Mobile Tech Videos. Please check us out at mobiletechvideos.com. Subscribe if you enjoy seeing the content I produce on a daily basis. Be sure to visit the forums that I've linked you to in the More Info section uh, for more uh, information. And as always, good luck.